Although verifying the exact losses sustained by Russia and Ukraine is challenging, compelling evidence suggests that the Russian military has suffered substantial reductions in terms of combat jets, helicopters, and drones. The success of Ukraine can be credited to their effective deployment of manned portable air defense systems. These lightweight, shoulder-mounted surface-to-air missiles proved highly effective in neutralizing airborne threats flying at low to medium altitudes. Ukrainian forces received a substantial influx of these manpads from over a dozen countries, resulting in a significant boost to their air defenses. Today, we'll explore the capabilities of these manpads. Be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel to stay updated with our latest content. When ranked in ascending order based on range, the Strela II occupies the 10th position. This Cold War-era missile system was manufactured in large numbers for the Soviet Union and its allies. Despite the availability of newer systems, the Strela remains in service in many countries and has been widely used in different parts of the world. The Strela II was introduced in 1970 and has a weight of approximately 33 pounds. It has a maximum range of 2.6 miles and can engage aerial threats at an altitude of 1.4 miles. Up next at number 9 is Strela 3, which is an upgraded variant of Strela 2. Introduced in 1974, this manpads brought significant improvements over its predecessor. This advanced system exhibits superior resistance to jamming and decoy flares, allowing it to track cooler targets over extended ranges and engage maneuvering targets with exceptional precision. It weighs around 35 pounds and comes with a maximum range of 2.8 miles. It can engage aerial threats at an altitude of 1.9 miles. Ranked at number 8, Grom entered the scene in 1995, its name derived from the Polish word for thunder. It's based on the Soviet-made Igla Manpad. It's armed with a 72mm anti-aircraft missile and comes with a single-use launcher, a grip stock, and a coolant unit. It has a weight of 36 pounds and utilizes an infrared homing guidance system. This system has an operational range of 3.4 miles and is capable of engaging targets at altitudes of 2.2 miles. At number 7 is IGLA, which is another Soviet-era surface-to-air missile system that entered service in 1981. Based on the Strela family, it features an improved rocket motor and seeker system. These upgrades give it improved abilities to counter agile aircraft and effectively handle modern infrared countermeasures. This manpad weighs around 39 pounds, making it easy to transport and deploy in various combat scenarios. The IGLA is equipped with a sophisticated guidance system, enabling it to track and engage aerial targets with exceptional accuracy. It has a maximum range of 3.7 miles and can intercept airborne threats at altitudes of 2.2 miles. At number 6 we have Piorin, which derives its name from the Polish word for Thunderbolt. The missile is based on the Grom system produced by the Mesco company in 2019. This manpad underwent significant enhancements to increase its detection sensitivity of the warhead and engagement of targets at extended distances. It's resistant to electronic jamming and can engage targets during the night. Weighing around 36 pounds, this Polish manpad offers portability and easy deployment for troops. It features an advanced infrared homing system with an argon-cooled seeker, ensuring precise target tracking and engagement. With a maximum range of 4 miles, it effectively neutralizes airborne threats at considerable distances. It's designed to engage targets at altitudes of up to 2.5 miles, providing comprehensive air defense coverage. Ranked at number 5 is Star Street. This short-range British manpad is manufactured by Thales Air Defense. It's known for its exceptional speed, reaching more than 3,000 miles per hour, making it the fastest short-range surface-to-air missile in this list. The system utilizes advanced guidance technology for precise target tracking and engagement. This British manpad paints its target with three laser beams, increasing the likelihood of hitting the target. Starstreak has been in service with the British Army since 1997. Weighing around 31 pounds, it offers excellent portability and maneuverability with a maximum range of 4.3 miles. It can hit targets as high as 4.3 miles. Up next is the Mistral, which is a French short-range air defense system manufactured by MBDA. These missiles can also be mounted on vehicles, ships, and helicopters. 
It's equipped with a friend or foe system and is operated by a two-person crew. Its seeker has a narrow field of view, ensuring the rejection of decoys and interference while maintaining precision in target engagements. Introduced in 1988, this man pad weighs around 43 pounds with a maximum range of over 4.3 miles. It can engage targets at altitudes of up to 2.5 miles. At number 3, we have Sunger. Turkey introduced this system in 2022. However, Ukraine is still awaiting the delivery of these missiles. It's armed with a high-explosive warhead for direct attacks and comes with fire-and-forget mode. It can also be mounted on various platforms. This man pad can be launched simply by using voice commands and visual instructions. The missile is equipped with upgradable identification friend or foe instructions. With a maximum range of 5 miles, it can hit targets at an altitude of 2.5 miles. At the number 2 spot is none other than America's Stinger, which is arguably the most iconic man pads ever produced anywhere in the world. The first versions of Stinger entered service in 1981, and a number of improved variants have been introduced since then. During the 80s, the Stinger missiles played a pivotal role in the ultimate defeat of the Soviet Union in Afghanistan. The total weight of a Stinger is approximately 35 pounds. It utilizes an infrared homing guidance system which allows it to track and engage targets based on their heat signatures. With a maximum range of 5 miles, the Stinger is capable of engaging targets at considerable distances. The engagement altitude of the Stinger reaches up to 2.4 miles, enabling effective interception of aerial threats at significant heights. At the number one spot, we have RBS-70. Developed by Sweden in 1977, this man pad stands as a highly capable air defense solution. It's armed by the RB-70 missile, which is also in use in a number of other Swedish missile systems. It weighs around 33 pounds. The man pad utilizes a laser beam riding missile as its guidance system. With a maximum range of 5.6 miles, it can neutralize targets at significant distances. The engagement altitude of the RBS-70 reaches up to 3.1 miles, allowing it to effectively intercept airborne threats at significant heights. The delivery of newer man pads such as the Stinger, Mistral, and Starstreak, along with the effective usage of older systems, has proven to be crucial in downing Russian aircraft and deterring further attacks. As the conflict evolves into urban warfare, the importance of man pads in Ukraine's defense strategy will continue to rise.